We've all heard jokes and stories about how catnip makes cats act like they are high or drunk, but why exactly does it affect our cats this way? Your cat will be rolling on its back, loudly purring and meowing, drooling, zoning out, rubbing against everything. What is actually going on there? Well, the truth is that we don't exactly know scientifically how it works, but scientists do believe that catnip clings to the cat's happiness receptor in the same way that a recreational drug may affect the human brain. So does catnip really make our cats high? Well, catnip is believed to have a hallucinogenic effect in cats. Inhaling the aroma of catnip will excite and stimulate your cat's senses, making your cat act euphoric and causing them to go wild for a little bit. Now weirdly, if a cat ingests catnip, it has the opposite effect. Cats will then tend to mellow out after they have eaten something that has catnip inside of it. However, catnip affects different cats differently. Your cat's sensitivity to catnip is hereditary. Only about two-thirds of domesticated cats are affected by it. Young kittens and elderly cats are also rarely affected. So don't be disappointed if your cat doesn't go super crazy, it just might be one of the three cats which don't go crazy. Also, like any drug, if you give your cat catnip too often, it may lose its effect over time as a tolerance is built via repeated frequent use. Everything in moderation. Some cats, usually males, will actually get quite aggressive when they are on catnip, and in this case, it's best to leave the cat alone for 15 minutes or so, because the cat will likely need a nap afterwards anyways. Surprisingly, catnip even works on large cats such as lions, bobcats, and cougars. There are plenty of funny other videos online of large cats on catnip rolling around suddenly acting like kittens instead of the predators that they are. Some trappers will even use catnip to lure predators such as these, like mountain lions, to get them away from their property. You can spray a toy with catnip and watch your cat go wild, but if you spray a lion's toy with catnip, you can expect it to get completely destroyed and even eaten. Zookeepers will usually spray a log of wood with catnip for the animals in captivity, so that way they don't destroy any expensive toys. Oddly though, catnip has a much stronger effect on younger wild animals rather than adults. This is strange because the opposite effect is observed in house cats. Catnip has even been used by humans for thousands of years. Catnip is closely related to mint, rosemary, oregano, and basil, and many people use it in their teas for relaxation. Some cultures throughout history have even smoked or chewed it for therapeutic effects, and sometimes even for hallucinogenic effects. However, we would definitely not encourage that because it's not clear if it is safe or not. So if you think that you have a wildlife or pest infestations problem such as raccoons, skunks, or possums, we would be happy to help you out. Give us a call at 855-WILDLIFE or visit wildlifexteam.com for more information. Thank you so much and we'll see you later. Having trouble with wildlife in your home or office? Wildlife X Team is your solution to get rid of the raccoons, bats, rats, and snakes. Having a professional team, we offer both residential and commercial animal removal methods by using innovative and integrated techniques. Our services include animal trapping, dead animal removal, nuisance wild animal control, and animal capture. What are you waiting for? To get 24-7 service, call us at 855-WILDLIFE for an affordable solution for your nuisance wildlife issues.